Now on News Channel 15, an early morning bar fight ended in Fort Wayne's first homicide of the year. Good evening, I'm Alyssa Ivinson. Police say two men were fighting outside of DuPont Bar and Grill just before four this morning when one was shot and killed. News Channel 15's Aaron Rogers spoke with a friend of the victim who was at the bar with him. She has our top story. Yeah, Alyssa, the coroner says the shooting victim is 32-year-old Damian Miller II. But people there this morning say there was no need for this to become the first homicide of the year. A night of fun took a deadly turn. It just froze me as soon as I heard the gun go off. Christopher Bradley says he worked with Damian Miller. They were bar hopping between the Rusty Spur and DuPont Bar and Grill after going to see a friend play at the Spur last night. Me and Damien were waiting for one of the uh, bartenders there, which we were friends with, to give us a ride home. That's when he says the bouncer asked them to leave. It was closed and they were make, making sure all the patients were exiting at the time. Officers say the fight started inside and then spilled outside into the sidewalk where the victim was fatally shot. One of them had a handgun and shot the other one. Damien's co-worker says the bouncer came outside where the two were standing waiting on their ride. A scuffle ensued, and the the bouncer fired two shots into my in my friend's chest. He's upset because he says Damien wasn't armed. There was no weapon other than the weapon that killed my friend. Evidence of this morning's shooting was hard to find. This afternoon, there was a full parking lot and business as usual. It was a little scary, but I feel safe. I mean, I'm here to watch the game, and it could happen anywhere. Officers say this shooting is no indication of crime to come in the city. I mean, it seems to be an isolated incident, and we're just going to deal with it as that for right now. Now, I did make some calls to the manager of the bar and police, but they would not confirm if the bouncer was involved. And officers do say they have no suspects in custody. Aaron Rodgers, News Channel 15.